Welcome back to Bags on the Go. Bags on the Ghost? Nah. What about the Tesla Model 3? My Parisian in the fall. That's how it went. Welcome back to Bags on the Go, and I'm on the go. And look, see the snow? Snow's coming down, but I'm about to go grab a new toy. Uh, All right, so we're 30 minutes out. We're headed to, so we're headed to Wyoming, Michigan right now to pick up a 1984 uh, Pontiac Parisian wagon. Um, yeah, so I'm getting a wagon right now. That's is it's on my list. I got the trailer. I got my uh, co-pilot with me today, Myron. How many wagons they made? Oh, uh, just shy of seventeen thousand. That's pretty rare. Yeah. Okay. For ninety four, for eighty four. Okay. Yeah. We'll be there soon. Tim, 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 James going to buy a car. I should actually act like I'm gonna try and buy it out from under him and start a bidding war right now. Just to fuck up the sale. <laughs> Didn't wanna walk across the grass, that was nice of him. Got the woody. Like the back got the uh, fillers oh, missing. the fillers are missing. Like the front. Don't it, don't it smell like morning fresh? Good morning. Yeah. Hello. Hello. Good morning. Hello. Hey. Good morning. Get safe travels, huh? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Up and early. Yeah. Oh, okay. Facebook. Uh huh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Who's those pictures? Yeah. That's pretty cool yeah. for a 92 year old. Yeah. I'm thinking. <laughs> that is pretty cool. Yeah. yeah. He's a cool old guy. This was his baby. <laughs> what, how old Where's is the, the Buick? Andrew has the Buick. Oh, uh, yeah. What Buick? I don't know if it's a 92 we'll or something. Or something. It's oh, a newer one. oh, okay. Well, compared I'll, to I'll this, I'll call you. I'll get sign you pictures if you oh, want that one please, when you're ready to sell it. Please do send me old things. Uh, so this I, is the 3.8. Same thing I collect. Okay. This is the 3.8 engine, isn't it? I need to buy some of the stuff you got. Yeah. 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 I got 80. Five, I believe it is. Four, oh, nice. 86 Monte Carlo. Oh, nice. 94. Yeah, I think that's the V6. Ooh. Yeah, cool. But, but this is like an old black moth boss. He kept my It does smell moth. like it keeps the rats out, right? right? Yeah. Oh, wow. It and looks everything's all written down on it. Oh, okay. Oh, where's that book at with all the information? Oh. Why don't you record that? I thought you were been I thought you don't I might have had recorded it. You shut the door. Damn. The blue seats. The strong smell of mothballs to keep the rats away. Oh. 
cockpit. Why do you think they called it a cockpit? Huh? They call it a cockpit. Oh, I don't know. Yeah. Where the third seat at? Damn, look at this. Oh, yeah. Oh, right lift that third seat. Well, you don't know how to lift it. It's a switch right here. Is it? Hold on. Oh, yeah, it ain't moving. What? So it's my first time. Crazy. <laughs> well, I couldn't imagine. That's, that look comfortable. He even got a cigarette. Yeah. In the back? Yeah, so ashtray right, right here. Everybody was smoking. Yeah. You smoked with your parents back in the day. Smoking doobies. Get this tent off of here. Oh man, this is a classic tent right here. You see that film? <laughs> Bill sheets. What is this? Just this is just a ledger. Yeah. What? Oil. Blue. What? Miles oil. Filters. Oh wow, he got everything on here. Mhm. Mm this is new radiator belts, hoses. That's what he had to buy for it or something. He had done it so he could put it in his wallet, I think. Oh, this is a Fram filter. <laughs> Jeez. So um, he wrote down the words to Here Comes Peter Cottontail because he'll always like to sing. And look how much kibasa was at the price. That's how much he bought for and ham. How much a pound. Dollar what was 40. this for? My dad just wrote this stuff down. We just found these notes. Did he own a business? No, he just liked to write stuff down. He just wrote stuff down. When he bought words, so here comes Peter Cottontail. Oh, wow. Because he wanted to know that, and then he wrote down how much kibasa was that year and how yeah. much it was. Yeah. <laughs> wow. I've never heard this one. Here comes mm. Peter Cottontail, hopping down the bunny trail. Hippity hoppity Easter's on its way. Uh-uh. Bring in every girl never. boy. Basket full of Easter toys. Things to eat. Oh, say. <laughs> Never heard it. I got an old, so, old, old song. So never, the, all these oil changes. Yeah. Oh. December of 99. This thing was still getting oil changes. Wow. He retired for Consumers Power. He's a big union guy. Oh, okay. His goal was to um, retire longer than he worked, and he made that. He retired over 37 years now. He just went to a retirement party just before he passed away. That's a good road. I know. He retired more than longer than you were. Uh huh. <laughs> yep. And it's a 97 Buick with Saber. Okay. He's got paperwork like that for that one too. Oh, okay. <laughs> wow. Well, I like it. I'll take it. Okay. Yeah. Just what you were looking for? Yeah, yeah, something different. This is this is it. It is different. No, I'm getting. You fix these up. Yeah, this this the route I'm on right now. Just bring it back to life. Keep it original as possible. Oh, yeah. Make it look good. Put the wood back on it. Wrap it or something, or paint it. It all depends on what I decide during the moment. What it deserves. But I like to bring it back to his glory. Mm -hmm. Got a clock on it. Four. There's five of us. Yep. My dad, he died of COVID last December. So I know the feel of it. Yeah, he'd probably like that. You bring this thing back to life. Mm -hmm. He would like it. Yeah, just, you know, it's a good car. It deserves it. You getting got, don't worry. Don't hit the house.
Turn the headlights on. Come on. Woo! <laughs> that thing as long as the trailer is. The extra three inches to that line. Yeah. Right there you there. go. Yep. Oh, ain't nobody coming. Man. Look at it. Woo! I gotta put the wood back on it. Oh, I gotta put the wood back on it. She's gorgeous. Let's do one more good old walk around while it's in the air. Then we're gonna go ahead and take off. Front looks good. All of the um, bumper fillers on here just got a little corner. That side look good over there, but it's not missing. So the impact strips had a good life. He only bumped into something one time. And this, this, this is just, is out of here. It's gone. It's starting to flake off now. Picking up my Parisian in the fall. That's how it went.
All right, so if you asked me a year ago, could I see myself buying a wagon? I would have told you no. The only reason why I bought this wagon is because for one, I like the Parisian. I really do, I like the four doors and the rear tail lights. Uh, they're always one of my favorite cars too. Uh, my neighbor used to have one. Um, it didn't last long, they had crashed it, but always like the car and plus they look good on rims too when i see them boys from chicago and they have them looking real good um and then i saw this one online it looked like it didn't have no rust holes in it it looked very clean so i said you know what i think i want a wagon so i went crazy searching online searching online just trying to get familiar with the car looking at different ones and stuff and I couldn't find many so I said oh since I couldn't find many I think I need to be the guy that's online talking about my wagon so you know what I'm gonna be doing it's gonna be more and more videos with the wagon y'all so <laughs> that's welcome into the team um, the owner he was the original owner he passed away and um, he was 92 years old and he took very good care of this car And um, his daughter, they decided to sell the car off. So I messaged them on Facebook and I asked them, can I come and buy the car? And they said, sure, wait till this weekend. So here it is Sunday and now I got it on my bed. And this car is just another Caprice. Just another Caprice, just rebadged the Pontiac. But essentially, the same car wagon life long roof crew I just got it home oh she looking good around here yeah, it looks like I own a wagon around here. Man, she looks good. I'm not going to leave it here, though. You know where I'm headed with this next. We're going to the shop. I got to get this old window tent off. And we're going to start with the detail. Just got to wash her up, that's all. Just get her cleaned up. And then, you know, we're going to work on making it look a lot better from here on out. Gotta get some air in all four of these tires. You can tell it's set. Look at that sidewall on the ground. It's gonna start eating up the tire. See, I roll down the window. <laughs> this tire needs some air in it too. something with me just so I can give it a good bath
Now, I don't know how long it sat. I didn't ask all those questions. I didn't get to that question. But I'm gonna go through all of it, all the fluids, everything before we take it on a cruise anywhere. Uh, but yeah, I'm about to give it a wash just to get it a little nice and a little clean. And then we're gonna take it in, turn the heat on, get this tent off. But we're gonna try. When it's purple like that, oh, it fights you every way, every step of the way, too. Uh, so, two ways you can open it here or here. favorite part about the wagon by far that's fun that's cool <laughs> Let's do a good walk around this morning. Got that tent off so you can see all the way through her now. You see that back seat. I wish y'all could smell the inside of this car. The guy put mothballs in here. So uh, it's super strong. I'm looking to get a detail on this thing and uh, hopefully find that pack of mothballs and get it out of there right away. Got that window down so it can air out. So the only damage I've really seen on this car is this. It's Bondo. Already on it. Um, the other side too is a little, it's a little beat weathered, it's aged, roof rack, everyone is there, they look like they chrome, they look good, roof rack, center bars are attached, just move them so they spaced out. Everything is here. No mind, no uh, big cracks in the dash, just minor little cracks like right here and stuff, like right there. She's just dirty. Old man owned her and drove her. What's up? Put that back right there. I thought that wasn't there. I just found that right now. That's awesome. That's what's up. We just completed that dash. Got the clock. Temperature. Stuff like that. And the old school radio. Lighter. Mirror for this uh, passenger side. Let's look at the headrest. I mean a headrest headliner. Seats look good just dirty you know it's gonna need a brand new carpet it's gonna need a new cleaning bottom of the doors I've seen worse just dirty 
seats ain't got no tear, no tears in them or nothing, even the driver one. And they ain't hardly age. This back seat is one little spot right here. That's it. that cover over this seat because it smells like mothballs <laughs> mm -hmm. see it look good for the driver's seat defrog for the uh, rear window headlights throw the window up and down these are door switches we got power doors Yeah, she idle down now. She runs good. She runs good. She you can you barely hear her running now. Nice and smooth. You got AC. Yeah, everything's here. Filthy. Just gotta clean it up, hit it with some paint. That's about it. Good little walk around this morning. I love the 80s. I can't wait to see this car next to my Caprice. Oh, they're gonna look pretty good. They're gonna look pretty bad to the bone next to each other. All right, y'all. Uh, let me know what you think down below in the comment section. The bag's on the go in the wagon in a per Parisian wagon, 84. Like this video, got more to come. get a startup video so I can show y'all how smooth how smooth this steering wheel how smooth this steering wheel is when I'm driving it's like it got better power steering than my Caprice than my Caprice does lap real quick look how smooth that steering wheel is they're barely even moving need some brakes on this car I can feel that pre that pedal is pretty tight well not tight it's like loose when I press it it ain't really it ain't really breaking like that so I gotta be careful Look how smooth that steering wheel is. You can literally just turn the car with your fingers. So she's big, but the mobility, look at that. Thing just spins. <laughs> so, hey y'all, 
today's the first day of me rolling around and me owning the wagon and uh i appreciate everyone reaching out telling me stories about the time they family used to have the wagon and what they used to do now a dollar rides in the back to re to rekindle your childhood of riding in the back seat i'm charging one buck so make your appointment i'll take you around the block make you feel like a kid again <laughs> this bag is on the go it's my first 24 hours owning the wagon and it's been one of my happy days here so yeah i appreciate it everybody been giving me good 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 feedback on it they like yeah i remember that car my family never had a wagon nobody in my family had a wagon so i don't have any childhood memories of riding around or seeing the wagon so hey but you did so reach out and, and come on by check it out i don't mind if y'all want to come and take a look at the wagon come take a look at it you want to sit in the back sit in the back let's look at it just this is just a car you just just gotta look at it y'all remember that video on facebook would you just look at it man she's gorgeous she is gorgeous so remember y'all you want to go for a ride accommodate three so that's uh three bucks a ride we're going to try to book out that wood grain that wood grain just peeling off all right so thank you y'all for watching bags on the go Make sure you like, share, and subscribe. It helps the channel grow. Comment down below. Tell me all the stories. I'm going to say that and say that over and over every time. Do it. And I'll see y'all next time.